Okay, so we waited a long time and it has done the update. I was going to avoid it, but what are you going to do? It says, for an optimal flight experience, we are going to update the drone's battery. This update requires your... The battery should remain unplugged... Wait, remain plugged to the power supply throughout the whole procedure. What? Maybe let's do it later. Can we fly at all with all these machines? The biggest issue is, can they let you fly? With a drone in your hand, tap or hand launch. Okay, that's cool. Enable hand launch. Wait two seconds for the motors to start up. Launch your drone up into the air. Sure, enable it. Oh, I have... I have camera feed. That's cool. That's good. Uh, now, what I want to take off in the kitchen. Ooh, I don't know. Maybe we'll take everything out of the way. We could try it. We could try it, but it would be scary, scary, scary stuff. I don't know if I'm if I'm ready. We could try it. Maybe we'll point the camera the other way for the sake of our safety. And if we were to take off, it's maybe it's just the one button. Let's see. Just press the button here. Maybe it would take off. Okay, it works. Okay, it works fantastically well. It is very, very stable, but I'm not going to risk anything else. We've seen it go up, we've seen it come down, and it looks like this is going to be fun, guys. So, um, thanks for watching, and that was your local Google guide here from Irvine, California, Woodbridge, testing out the Anafi. And boy, was that a fun flight for me because it did not crash. It was great right off the bat so after the you know doohickey and all the installation and all that stuff it did a good job and i'm happy about that so there we have it thanks for watching and i'll see you all in the next one